On today's exploration, we're exploring an abandoned jail that sits on top of an active courthouse. Built in the 1930s, a lot of the industrial influence from the era is still seen within the rivets that hold the steel panels together within the cells. The jail eventually closed down in 2000 due to capacity issues of having 200 inmates crammed in a small jail. Today I'm joined by Big Banks, or Big's dad. I'll have their channels down in the description. And without further ado, let's check out what's inside. Walk around, take our time now. Like, <laughs> this is nuts. Fully legal. So that's the floor on the top floor. I can do this. God, I've got 12 seconds for your girls, nigga. Somebody has some uh, Chipotle. Yeah, they should be in. Look at this nice porcelain. I wonder if there's a dull water. No. No, let's cut off. Decommission it. Check this out. I actually got yeah, nice. people carved into the door. The little angel. She was actually really nice. Yeah, very nice people here. I'm sure I like this one, but it's been welded shut. Ouch. These are so solid. I guess they have to be. Here's our fire suppression right here. Just a fire hose. Looks like they closed off of these. Nobody would use them, but I mean, to even get up here, you'd have to go through the front office, which is not really possible. You can see all this inmate graffiti. Looks like Mary Magdalene. Only one with a mattress. See how comfortable these are. Ooh, man, that doesn't feel very good. There's almost no padding on this. <laughs> it's terrible. Watch out, go get my head bumped. Part for you. That's pretty awesome. It's so small, like this little area. Like I can touch this and I'm only 5'11". This is probably like the creepiest part of it all. Ouch. This is really creepy. Holy crap. I wonder what this was. It's real thick. Oh look, it looks like a holding cell maybe. Oh, it looks like the light's still on. That was weird. I thought I had um, enough juice in that battery to continue with the whole place, but uh, I guess I didn't. Threw in a new battery, and uh, we're just gonna keep checking out this massive, massive small gel because it looks small from the outside, but once you get in, it's actually pretty decently sized. So uh, let's join up Banks and uh, Urbex Dad. Yeah, so this is a whole new cell. That's what I'm saying. It's weird. It, you it's know, big. It almost makes me think that maybe they repurposed this holding cell because there's a larger holding cell over there. Really? And so possibly maybe this got turned into a cell because they were talking about they had to build a new jail because yeah. of capacity issues. So maybe they're repurposing this thing, hey, you know. I, mean, I haven't even gone over that side yet, so I'm glad I got to see that over there. Yeah, a lot. Of, I mean, it just continues, like I said, the, the artwork on the wall, people, you know, inscripting whatever it is, you know, pictures, you know. So I read one that said killer. Yeah. So, like, I, there had to be. Oh, well, there's no doubt. Yeah. There's no doubt they would have housed, you know, murderers or whatever in here until they go out to, like, a you know, larger state prison. Um, but yeah, I just, I'm amazed by this place. Yeah. It's crazy. I still can't believe we got permission. I know. I'm still like, <laughs> yeah. We don't have so to weird. whisper. We don't have to do yeah. that. Guys, be quiet. It's nuts. 
Absolutely nuts. Yeah. What is this right here? It's uh, some action. action. I don't know. Oh, if, to unlock the cells? I'm, I'm assuming these are like individual cells and you have to activate it to open up the doors. Uh, oh, yeah, you're right. That kind of makes sense when you count them out. Yeah, so that's exactly what this is. So you would yes. select which cell you want to open up. I believe that's cell four, three, two, one. One, yep. And crank it open. I noticed because there was gears on some of these, the sliding cell doors. Yeah. And I wondered how you open it. It's very oh, old school. Because you got that whole row right there. And how is the mechanisms for sliding it? Yeah, absolutely. That's awesome. Look this off. Yeah. I, I had my camera in manual focus that whole time. No. See, that's why I don't mess with manual settings. Dude. I forget too much. I think I had my camera in manual focus this whole trip. No. Are you serious? You need to review your footage. This. I mean, you can even see down here. Where people's like cut out magazines oh, yeah. of, of women. A bunch, bunch of porn. I'm sure, I'm sure the warden wasn't too happy about that. It says you've got to take the good with the bad, the happy with the sad. Love what you've got and remember what you had. Cool. Looks like people tracing their hands as well. Two hands. This is their, uh, their camera system from the day. Looks like they used like a foam bedding and then just stuffed the camera in the middle so it wouldn't move. And uh, if you look on this side, it's got a like crazy lock box. Pretty interesting. As you can see, this is hanging very low. Like I can't, I'm 5'11 and I touch that. At this time, the old jail is being used as storage for court documents and there are no current plans to make it available to the general public. Well guys, if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing and leaving a like. That's all I got. Catch you guys on the next exploration.